the year 2020 will be memorable for everyone, including myself as an artist, and for the community of Canmore as a whole. For me, it would always represent the year when I had to abruptly stop painting and become a full-time educator of my two sons. They were then seven and nine years old. And like most parents during the spring lockdown, I had to find creative ways to get my kids outside to burn off some steam and avoid confrontation. They're boys after all. Most days, we ended up hiking around and rediscovering our backyard and everyone found peace within this chaos. Or sort of. For the community though, spring was spent trying to push back people who wanted to visit Camor. I could not blame people who felt like escaping the city for a day to come and play in the mountains, since I was a lucky one with unlimited access to them, but we had to protect our community from the pandemic. Then summer came with crowds of people looking for recreation in and around Camor. Local Camerites started to complain about people invading our own town and using our recreation facilities, including trails and parks. And that animosity left me with an, an uneasy feeling. I felt like we were all invading our mountains, whether we live in, in it or not. I came to Camor 20 years ago, and for all those years, I have been surrounded by these beautiful mountains. I have been hiking and climbing them all, and all the while, I was wondering how I could paint those majestic mastodons. I wanted my paintings to feel right. So in my mind last year, this happened. By spending so much time in the mountains with my family, I wanted to pay homage to the mountains that are around Camor, a scene from Camor, which means with our impact on the land. The mountains are our heaven but we keep invading them with our houses, neighborhoods, and infrastructures. Yet, they will be there when I die, as they were before I was born. They are rock, water, trees, animals, insects, while I am just human. Something in the way is a project that is close to my heart, as it emerged from all these reasons which became my foundation. These things in the way painted in front of the mountains are part of our town's infrastructures, but also our collective history and how it is rapidly changing.